Hi, welcome back. In this video, I will discuss how to apply Kruskal algorithm to find the minimum spanning tree and the total weight of uh, minimum spanning tree. This is the solved example number 2. The link for other solved examples is given in the description below. Kruskal algorithm is a famous uh, greedy algorithm which is used to find the minimum spanning tree given graph should be weighted, connected and undirected. In this example, I am going to consider uh, this graph and then uh, I will find the minimum spanning tree as well as the total weight of minimum spanning tree. In Kruskal algorithm, very first thing what we do is uh, we will note down all the uh, nodes here. So first I will note down all the nodes in this case that is uh, node A, node B and then uh, node E here, node G and then we have a node D here, node C and then finally uh, node F here. Once I note down all these uh, nodes in the given graph, I have to draw the edges in such a way that uh, the smallest weighted edge should be drawn first and then uh, the next uh, smallest weighted edge and so on. But one thing that we have to keep in mind is uh, whenever I draw an edge, it should not form a cycle here. Now if I uh, scan this particular uh, entire graph, uh, this is the minimum uh, weighted edge. So I will draw this particular edge that is A to B and uh, the weight is 1. From the remaining edges, the minimum weighted edge is uh, between C and F. So I will draw that particular edge here that is C to F in this case and the weight is equal to 2 here. Similarly, from the remaining uh, edges, the edge between you can see here E and F the weight is 3 that is the smallest so I will draw that particular edge here that is uh, the weight is 3. Again among the remaining uh, edges I think this is the smallest one that is uh, between B and C that is 4 we have so we will draw this particular edge here and then I will write the weight. From the remaining uh, edges uh, the minimum is I think it is uh, 5 between A and C but if I draw this particular edge from A to C it will form a cycle that is A B C is a cycle here so I should not consider this particular 5 I should consider the next uh, minimum uh, weighted edge so in this case uh, the next minimum weighted edge is uh, 6 here between C and D so I will draw that particular edge and then I will write the uh, weight here Next, uh, I have to consider the next minimum uh, weighted edge. Uh, the next minimum weighted edge is again, you can see here uh, 7. Uh, if I draw an edge between B and E, again it will form a cycle, so I should not consider it. Uh, next to 7 is 8 between uh, B and D. Again, if I draw this particular thing, it will form a cycle, I should not consider it. Similarly, for this one, D and F and uh, uh, edge here. If I consider this D and F, the weight is 9, but if I draw it here, it will form a cycle. So I should not consider that also. So the next minimum uh, weighted edge is uh, 10. I will draw this part of thing because it will not form a cycle in this case. And one more thing you can notice here, we have totally 7 uh, nodes. I have drawn uh, 6 edges. I should stop here because if I draw any edge from here onwards, it will form a cycle. So you have to stop constructing minimum spanning tree once you have drawn n minus one number of uh, edges where n is the total number of nodes in this case. So this is the final minimum spanning tree for this uh, given graph. Next uh, we will try to find the total weight of this uh, minimum spanning tree. So that is uh, total weight is equal to 1 plus 4 plus 6 plus 2 plus 3 plus 10 in this case which is equal to 1 plus 4 is 5 plus 6 is 11 12 13 14 15 16 plus 10 is equal to 26 units so in this uh, video I have discussed what is Kruskal algorithm how can we apply Kruskal algorithm to find the minimum spanning tree and then how to find the total weight of the minimum spanning tree here if you like this video do like and uh, share with your friends Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.